Welcome back, everyone, to Random Thoughts. Today, we have something a little different for you. This is actually pulled directly from the middle portion, we'll say, of a recent live stream where I had dove into a new game or a new genre, new at least to me, in Storybook Brawl. Now, this was one of my early wins, so I wanted to showcase it a bit, and here we are. So let's jump in. Uh, we haven't done Horde Dragon yet. So we need to level things quickly with this, I think. I don't know if this is worth it, but we're going to try it. Oh, woo. So if we don't attack first, we're in trouble. I mean, at least it's a 2-2 instead of a 1-1 now. Well, we did get a trigger, so that's nice. I will take it. I guess. I'm not sure. I really just want to protect this so it has a better chance to keep slaying. And obviously, if we're going to take the tree, we want it early on so we can generate as much of a health buff as possible. Oh, that's obnoxious. You have so many characters already. A doubly... I don't know if this is a good idea. Oh, 6-4 Minotaur is okay. Which means we probably want this other Minotaur. So we can level it up. Snow Angel. For every three good characters you buy, get a random good character. That's kind of cool. Seems maybe it would be a good game genre. Let's see, though. Yeah, I'm... It, it is definitely something that's popular. The genre. I know people really like auto battlers. I just don't know about it myself. As in what my opinion on it is, because I, I just haven't played them enough, and I don't know if they they really do it for me. Sell that. We want the doubly upgrade. You definitely need some health buffs, which is a problem. But yeah, they, I'm aware of the genre. I just haven't played them up to this point because it didn't seem all that enticing. But at the same time, I mean, I'm enjoying this so far. We get our butt kicked. Despite the high attack values, we just couldn't punch through anything. Or punch through enough things, I guess. We 
Maybe we want the cat? I don't know. We definitely want the doubly. We'll go with Sting. I wonder if this should be up front so that they're buffing it and it's more likely to slay something. The problem is all of our stuff dies on attack. Like, our opponent wins just by having more guys than us. We need Mad Mim to get upgraded and hopefully she give, gets health. Evil support. Um... The Minotaur is bigger. Merlin's hat, basically, we don't have any sleigh, right? Oh, we do have a sleigh. It'll be an 8-5. Whatever. We'll just take the cheaper spells. I think that's valuable. Queen of Hearts might be good here, but we can't get it anyway. I guess we might as well do that. I don't know what happens when we upgrade it. Will it stay good? Wait. Oh, this no longer gets the attack buff from these things. Not like it matters, because it's going to go away. Which thing's a familiar name? Yeah, we are getting rocked. Right, so, does this... First character is 10 health, character is the slay. I guess that's fine. Interesting. So it stays good. Brock Lee might be good. We kind of need a tank. Uh, we have a, a bunch of DPS characters. We can buff his attack. We need something with a bigger butt. Ah, oh, Ragnar. I didn't notice you were in here. I don't usually look at my opponent's names, as you can tell. <laughs> Actually, I don't know if we want that broccoli. Ah, oh, that's so obnoxious. Take yet more damage. We have nothing to buff the doubly's health, which is part of the issue.
This guy should be okay. Um, and we could pick up another one to upgrade him easier. Maybe the Kitty Cut Purse will become something, but probably not. It's because it's the first character that the helm is giving it so much health. Madame Mim having no attack herself is seriously problematic. Hey, this is actually a serious issue. Good thing our opponent doesn't have a ranged. We actually stand a chance now. We do have a treant, so that's cute. Of course, there's another doubly. Shrivel. That sounds unpleasant. We do have a bunch of mages. Could we please get things that we can upgrade? damage is not a lot. Neither is plus one, plus one, for that matter. Upgrading this thing was not worth it. I don't think. get multiple slay triggers. That's cute. Oh, maybe we're not. This thing is not attacking again. Come on. Like, we just can't find anything of value. Um, we're going to replace Mim. We can get the Evil Queen in once we uh, get some more upgrades. We need to both upgrade her and find another Wicked Witch of the West. funny, this game we found a whole bunch of support characters, but we could not for the life of us find them in the last one.
Oh, okay, Hoon. I didn't realize you were in this one. I'm assuming that's you. Hey, we found another Wicked Witch. Monkey paw? I guess that? I don't know if that's worth it. But we're gonna try it. Found another siren. Gigantify. Probably should have gone for that. I'm gonna freeze this because we want that upgrade. Yeah, it's a whole party. I didn't realize, like, like I said, I wasn't paying attention to the names. I hope one of us wins it. I'm gonna be upset if, like, this random person. Galvalin wins. I'm gonna be pissed. A drink me potion. Yeah, that's definitely what I'm doing. I'm gonna walk into a random place, see potions on the walls, and it says drink me. I'll definitely drink it. No. Geppetto seems pretty good. It's a big pig. They should have made it look more like Bebop. The Oni King is pretty big. Like, we're not winning this. Hercules back there. Oof. I mean, the uh, Slate Trigger was putting in work, but that's just too much to overcome. That That's a lot of stuff. I feel like this deck is way too fair. At the start of each brawl, your character's attack and health both become the highest of the two. Double your support bonuses. That seems like it's good. Maybe the double support thing would have been better. I don't know. Oh, shit. I missed a Baba Yaga there. We have some monsters. We actually have three monsters. I didn't realize how many we had. GG. Alright, so we we really need... There's a couple upgrades we need. We can get another Oni. Definitely want this guy, which we don't have enough for, apparently. We actually kind of want Jormungand, but...
That might be a mistake. I don't know. I think the cut purse has run its course. Hmm. We'll have to see. I mean, this feels like it's a, a decent setup, but maybe not. This is where it bothers me that I don't know what the attack sequence is or how the attacks are declared. Because where the Oni is positioned matters since you want to obviously allow the monsters to get the bonus as much as you can. So because I they hit Cupid onto the thing that summons my own or slays, I got to summon my own guy. That's kind of cute. I really like Pumpkin King, but it feels like it's not good enough unless you level it up. We need Oni Kings and Broccolis. Oh, there's a Broccoli. The border that's blue like this, indicating that they're evil, always throws me off. That it, I don't know, it, like having the different colored borders like that always signifies to me that it's a a different level or really a different rarity or something like that. Not that it's the alignment. So it, it, it throws me off doing this. Alright, so I'm up against Ragnar. Who's going to have a team of enormous MFers? Alright, let's see. Those are some big dudes. Didn't get to attack with my big dudes. Or at least not some of them. Yeah, we'd lose here. Well, maybe not. Like, there's a an exceptionally small chance. Oh, maybe not such a small chance. We got there! GG! The Slay and the Resurrect effect. Another Minotaur. We're just re-rolling to find the, the specific things. Okay, we found a broccoli. That's good. 1515 Baylor. An enemy character dies. Dracula's Saber? I don't think we want any of these. Yeah, the Resurrect on the enormous Oni. I didn't realize that they would come back with their buffs. Like, I didn't expect that. But I mean, just having the Resurrect means I have an extra guy. So it definitely paid off. 
it seemed good at the time when I took it. I didn't realize how how critical it can be. And here we go with Geppetto and 50,000 baby bears. That thing's big. Not big enough, apparently. You can be a big pig, too. That Echo Wood is getting out of control, though. Just saying. Uh, that thing's pretty big. We managed to get there. We got a W. We got a W. There we go. Maybe I'll I'll uh, strip that out and put it on YouTube. It's two wins under my belt. Feels good. One of them was on stream, so that feels even better. It always feels like if I do it off stream, it doesn't count. Most I got was third. Well, you get there. I mean, I... I stumbled on these, I think. I don't... As in... I don't think this was due to any particular set of skill that I happened to have or anything like that. It just... I happened to get lucky. Um, but I'm going to run a quick commercial, get some more water, and I'll be right back. So uh, I appreciate everybody that was hanging out. I appreciate all the follows. Um, we're going to be playing some Mythgard tomorrow, and then we'll be back on Monday after that, and we'll see what's going on then. But as always, everybody, thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. And Black Lives Matter.